The Ministry of Agriculture recently launched its data share platform in an effort to centralize the ministry's data, allowing for real-time data requests to be fulfilled. The data share platform created by Ms. Jenny Shen, an IT specialist attached to the Taiwan ICDF Overseas Volunteer Program, was a product of a joint collaboration between the Taiwan ICDF and the Ministry of Agriculture as part of an effort to address the shortcomings that currently exist within the agriculture sector. Ambassador of the Republic of China Taiwan to St. Lucia, His Excellency Peter Chien Chen, praised the IT specialist for her exemplary work during her time in St. Lucia. Over the past year, uh, Isha worked hard and diligently to help accomplish many works through her expertise on technology and coding. Agriculture data share platform is among one of the achievements in which she spends lots of work and effort to accomplish and we are so proud of her. Can we give her a big round of applause? And I believe uh, Isha definitely has some good experience working with the ministry, and this will become valuable memory uh, for her in St. Lucia. In the future, Taiwan will continue to work with St. Lucia to strengthen our cooperation at all fronts in the field of agriculture in order to promote food security for all people's well-being. Minister for Agriculture, Fisheries, Food Security and Rural Development, Honorable Alfred Prosper, expressed gratitude to the government and people of Taiwan for their continuous support in building capacity within the Agriculture Ministry. Minister Prosper notes that this initiative is of significant importance as data is pivotal to productivity and efficiency within the ministry. Data is important. It is one thing to capture data but it's also very expensive to capture it. When you capture it, it's costly. You have to manage it. You have to store it. Not doing that means everything we do will go to waste. And we have, have experienced it in some of the, the um, government agencies. We spend lots of financial resources to collect the data. We store it. But afterwards, we are unable to access it. I know of some persons who have left the public service with the data in the back pocket. I am hoping that with this new initiative that this will be a thing of the past. I am also very concerned in terms of capacity, training sufficient persons to manage that data. Minister Prosper says that with the increased provision of seamless information via the platform, the many departments within the ministry can now simulate better decision-making to effectively serve the people of St. Lucia. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anisia Antoine reporting.